It is Sunday, January 16th, 2022, about 12.15 a.m. And for several days, the East Coast winter storm has been talked about and it is finally here. As you can probably um, hear, it's either snowing or sleeting right now. I can't tell because it's so dark. Just, just try out the flashlight. It's not bright enough to see anything. Go ahead and try my phone flashlight see what pops up. Can't see too much. Looks like snow. It's definitely snowing. Or icing, one or the other. And I'm out here in a t-shirt and shorts, freezing my face off. Got my phone flash going, hopefully at least a little bit can be seen. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and resume this in the morning. Because not much can be seen right now, because it's so dark. Actually, it is technically morning now, but in daylight, I'll be back. All right, it's a little over an hour later. It's about 1.25 now. And the snow is definitely uh, getting heavy. I imagine the yard will be fully encased by the time I wake up. I don't think it's starting to stick yet, but soon that will change. It is now 7.22 a.m. and this is what we're looking at. This is a site I have not seen in over three years. I wish I had something to measure that with so I could get an idea of how much accumulation built up overnight. Probably about three to five inches, maybe a little more. Maybe a little less. I know it's definitely not less. But at one point they called for eight inches of snow, but that's total BS. That doesn't happen in South Carolina. I think it's sleeting right now. And it is about 27 degrees right now with a wind chill factor of four degrees. So it's pretty freaking cold right now. I'm gonna get some more documentation later. So, see y'all then. You are going outside in that weather. No way. Move aside. All right, if you're gonna be difficult, I'm just gonna go out this way. Don't even try, don't even try. I don't want her going out here in this weather. It's not a good idea. But what I wanna do is a little bit more documentation on the snow and more of an update you can see several inches has accumulated despite what i said earlier i think this might actually be eight inches and you can actually see the sun poking out a little bit but it's still snowing it's not as brutal as it was in the morning The wind. I mean, wind chill factors at times got below zero, but it's warmed up a little bit. 
it's still in the 20s, but it's doesn't feel like it's zero degrees anymore. I'm gonna find a spot here and give you an idea of how how deep the snow really is. I guess right here will work. That's a good half foot right there. If not more, I don't know. It's a lot of snow. It's definitely more than what we've been getting these last two winters. The last time we had a snowstorm like this or anywhere near like this was December of 2018. So it's been over three years. The trampoline is fully encased. I checked the weather. It says we're supposed to get more next weekend. But that's only a slim chance at this point. We won't know till the last minute whether or not it'll snow again. That is beautiful. You can't go very far back there. Swamp back there is frozen. The creek obviously isn't because that's constantly running water. I don't have my phone on me, I don't want to go too far. But yeah. I don't know if I'll be able to go anywhere today because the road is completely covered in snow. Or at least it was. I don't I haven't taken a look at it in a few hours. It's not too bad, or it's not as bad as it was before, but hopefully it pairs up a little bit more so that I won't, won't be stuck home for the entire day. But it's probably about 3.20 p.m. now. Um, this camera battery's about to die. I need to charge it up as soon as I get inside. But I might or might not do another updated clip on the snow. I'll at least do one tomorrow, showing the aftermath, and there's a dog dashing through the snow. But yeah, that is beautiful. Alright, that'll wrap it up for now. Gotta get this thing charging. Okay, this is the final result of the winter storm of January 2022. It's kind of more icy now because it froze overnight. There's ice underneath here too. It's about 9.30 a.m. now, Monday, January 17th, 2022, I think it is. And like I said before, they're calling for more snow next Friday, but whether or not that comes true, we won't know till last minute. Uh, it's more soft right here probably about 32 degrees right now so it's warmed up a bit still still very cold but warmer than yesterday for sure it's supposed to get up to about 38 today so I expect at least some of this to melt and Wednesday will be an absolute thawer because the high is 50 and the low is 40 so documenting all this while I can A 
I think in a little bit I'm gonna grab a ruler and just shove it in one of the empty parts of the snow so that I can know or get at least a rough estimate of how much I got. All I can do right now is guesstimate, but I don't know for sure how much I got until I measure. And I came out here with a t-shirt and shorts, so I'm freezing. Got a lot right there. That right there is probably a good foot. And that's obviously not all from precipitation itself. A part of that was also it just blown off the roof there. I guess that'll wrap it up for this video. So this was the winter storm of January 2022.